All right. So what I've got in here is some nutrients that I'm, you know, kind of done up for my uh, seedlings, and I've got all three pens in here. So let's uh, let's turn on some lights, turn on some power, and let's see what we got here. Okay. So for the Afria, what are we looking at here? We're looking a pure a pure. It's stable out at 4.95 ish. No, 4.9. 4.995 this one's over here at 4.8 oh, just turned off alright so 4.8 I mean it could be 4.89 but again that's that one decimal thing right so 4.8 this one's gone up oh it's still climbing a little bit here 5.02 and then what is the cheap one at 4.9 no 4.92 just jump up. All right, so let me give these a shake. Give it a little bit of a shake here, and then let it stable out. So that one's 5.02. This one's 4.8, and this one is 4.96. So, man, what uh, three different pens, same solution: 4.97, 5.04 and 4.8 on this one. Can you guys all see that? Yeah, I hope you can. 4.8 on that one. 5.04 on that one. And because you probably can't see it, I'm going to bring it up and I'm going to go 4.97 on that one. $23 pen. $123 pen. And a $140 pen. Wow. That comparison's pretty crazy. Um, from from the one decimal for being the most expensive pen, I, I think that is a loser. Like right off the hop, I, I say, you know, at 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 one decimal point, not enough. Why why can't we have it, you know, at to a higher level? Now I don't. I'm going to read the 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 very limited directions that came with this to see if there's a way to get a little bit accurate but I don't I don't think there is anything alright so now down to these two I haven't even calibrated this one today I calibrated this a few days ago and it's been sitting open because it's just this cheap one and I was thinking I was getting these great pens it's been sitting open exposed and you know that these are not supposed to do that and said I uh, maybe I'll get it back in here let's go yeah so look four Oh, that's 4.6 now. I didn't even change anything. Oh, it's not all the way in. That's why. The 4.75. I like. To, let me let me do this one at a time. So again, Blue Lab. I think we're 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 saying that that one is probably not the greatest. Give this one a shake. Five point oh six. Now these were all just calibrated, so why the hell, well, those two anyways, and they're not even close. Okay, maybe they are because of the difference of the, uh, the decimal point. 4.7, 3, 4, 5, 6, alright, let's let it. Stabilize here. Uh, this 30, 23 or $27 one is about as accurate or more accurate than that Blue Labs one at 140 Look, it's at 4.89, which is 4.9, right? That's what that one was coming up as. If I do 4.9, there we go. Stabilizing here hasn't changed. It took a while to go from 4.89 to 90, so I'd say that one's at 4.9, 9.1. juice there so it's actually in when there's only one pen in there right which one is it 5.2 this 
So it's 4.93, so this one's, there's a bit of a difference there. That one's still not stabilized yet either. Let's let it stabilize. Alright, so this pen, both pens have stabilized, one's at 5, one's at 5.14, and this one, if we get this in here, um, all within point one of each other, right? That one's at five, this one's at 4.9, and that one's at 5.1, two. So, again, uh, wow. Okay, let's pull these out real quick. And what I wanna do is I wanna put them back into, I'm gonna get give them a quick rinse into the uh, distilled water. Get them into the, into the calibration solution that, you know, we know this is at four, right? 4.07 after it's stabilized. It's got the smiley face. Okay, so that's 4.07. Into the calibration solution that's no, we know is up 4. Well, at least it was up 4 when we did it with the other one. Point eight is where this one was at. Back to the cheapo beepo. Give it a bit of a rinse. And then to the four. 3.97. Six. Give it a shake. Give it a swirl. And let's see what happens here. So 3.93, the other one was at 3.8, 3.94, oh, this one's climbing back up here. If it's climbing back up, let's give it a second to stabilize. Three point nine six. So what we're looking at here is going to jump up another one, or let's let's call it there. Three point nine six. Um. Oh, three point nine seven. Took a while to get to there. Three point nine seven. That's that's more more accurate than the hundred and forty dollar one. And then into here. What's this one going to give us? Blue light, you can't really see, eh? So, and this one, 4.05. So this one's off by 0.5. This one was off by 0.3. And this one was off, er, point, point zero 0.05. This one's off, right? If we know this is 4, and we did it earlier. That one's 4. This one got to 3.97. Oh, it turned off. 3.97, 3.97, 3 3.98, so 0 0.02, 0 0.03 off for the cheap one, and a full 0 0.2 off for this one. Well, ladies and gentlemen, um, I am hard pressed to keep either of these two cheap, these two expensive ones. I'm going back to the winner of this challenge. Man, I, I, it doesn't, how is that? How is a cheap one that has been used and abused less accurate than the two brand new hundred and some dollar ones? 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'll put to you the link in the description for all three of these pens, but uh, I can tell you that these two are not living up to my expectations, and they're going back. Like, I, I can't expect you to spend that kind of money and not be more accurate than that. It's crazy. So, another video brought to you by 420 Things Grow in Ontario. Um, like I said, guys, check the link for the descriptions that... Uh, if you need to buy anything off Amazon, you can get it there. Um, check out uh, the Mars Hydro stuff that I got going on over at uh, the Mars Hydro videos. There's a link in that description. And then uh, always indoorgrowingcanada.com. Use the coupon code 420 things. But uh, time for now is to say goodbye and uh, back on to uh, checking my pH with this bad boy. Cheap people stuff. Also, um, I'll give you the link, uh, I'll put the link in the description for these, uh, for these, uh, calibration stuff, right? Um, that's, uh, you just mix that with your, uh, deionized water and stuff, so. I didn't even use that, I used this stuff for that other one, it's still looking pretty good, so. <sighs> Bye for now. Learn something new every day, I guess, eh? More expensive is not always better.